Let's talk about sh baby. Hello and welcome to Food in Provence. I'm Hannah and I'm here to help you how to live a healthier and happier life. And today we're going to talk about your poop. Does it sound embarrassing? How come that when we hit teenage years and we are adults, it suddenly becomes a taboo? Well, when you go to a pediatrician with your baby or your child, one of the first questions is, how are your child's bowel movements? So, it shouldn't be a taboo at all, because let me tell you that if you like it or not, your bowel movements are very, very important. In fact, the shape, the size, the frequency and the color of your bowel movements can tell you a lot about your health and even you can find out if you have some underlying issues, some uh, problem, even some chronic disease. So don't worry to talk about your bowel movements, it's not embarrassing at all. And you can see here many things which you can use if you struggle with constipation. Constipation is actually the first one reason of doctor's visits every year. But don't worry, today we're going to be talking about some natural and home remedies, how to stop and relieve constipation. Hey, hello again, this is Hannah at Food in Provence and today we are talking about how to relieve constipation because constipation is one of the reasons, first one reason why people go to doctor every year. So you can see many things which can help you to relieve constipation but first of all, let me ask, what toilet do you have at your home? Uh, I'm sure you have this modern day toilet and we do as well but actually it can be one of the problems uh, of the constipation because if you take uh, modern day toilets uh, you are not sitting in the right position to eliminate it. Uh, maybe you have seen somewhere uh, around the world even in France you can see some so-called squat toilets um, I'm not asking you to install one at home, I'm just telling you that squatting is the body's natural way to eliminate waste. So you don't need to install squat toilet at home, just make sure that you put some bucket or some chair uh, which hate in your knees and uh, you can be in the squat position while uh, eliminating. Next thing, nutrition. Uh, no, no one and no doctor will argue this, that nutrition is the simplest solution and first step to uh, relieve constipation and have healthy bowel movements. Uh, there are many things which you can eat, but first of all, swap all things which don't contain fiber. Uh, refined carbohydrates, um, cheese, uh, hydrogenated oils, swap them for healthy uh, whole foods such as uh, cruciferous vegetables, leafy greens, everything which has fiber in it. We should uh, opt for uh, at least 25 but better between 25 to 40 grams uh, of fiber per day. So remember that when you're eating something and focus on, on some things such as hemp seeds, hemp seeds, dates, chia seeds, all these seeds and also nuts and of course fruits such as apples or pears, uh, squashes. Today is the first day of autumn, so I wear squashes, but there are squashes now everywhere, also berries. All these, um, all these things, all these whole foods have fiber in them, so you should definitely get them into your diet. Next thing, uh, maybe you recognize this wonderful plant which I have here, it's called aloe vera. 
and aloe vera gel and aloe vera juice actually you can uh, find it in a bottle like this uh, it's very anti-inflammatory and it helps your digestive system and it helps with uh, bowel movements so you can just take aloe vera gel in your smoothie in your morning juice uh, green juice of course and it will definitely help you with your bowel movements as is also so-called psyllium husk maybe you've heard of it it's called as a natural laxative so either you add it to some recipe or you take a teaspoon mix it with a little bit of water you wait for 15 minutes and then you drink it so dates chia seeds hemp seeds psyllium husk aloe vera juice don't forget to add these into your diet hello again this is Hannah food in Provence and today we are talking about healthy bowel movements and about uh, home remedies for constipation because love it or not bowel movements and healthy bowel movements are very important uh, we're not be talking today about how uh, what should the perfect stool look like? I put you a link um, uh, on the web page where you can find out. We're just talking today and focusing on remedies and nutrition, uh, what you can do to relieve constipation. So we already talked about fruits, uh, about vegetables, nuts, seeds, psyllium husk, um, aloe vera juice, aloe vera gel, which you can uh, add to your morning green juice or your smoothie, uh, but also exercise and hydration is very important. We are sitting too much and we are dehydrated. So make sure that you get some exercise every day, even if it's just a small walk or taking your, your dog. Uh, and hydrate yourself. You should drink at least two liters of water per day. So have it ready and encourage also your kids to drink enough. We are a constipated, dehydrated and magnesium deficient society. So make sure you get some uh, very good magnesium supplement and you can take it um, either in the evening. Uh, it will help you sleep and it will also help you with uh, eliminating the waste. Also, there are essential oils and herbal remedies which you can use to relieve constipation. One of my uh, number one aids when it goes to digestive system is um, peppermint essential oil, but also peppermint tea. Uh, drink peppermint tea uh, two to three cups per day or after each meal it will help you with digestion and when it comes to essential oil make sure you always dilute it because peppermint essential oil is very very powerful i add it sometimes to some recipe but i add just one maximum two drops of peppermint essential oil as it's very powerful if you have some digestive symptoms such as bloating, gas or some cramps, dilute uh, one or to two drops of uh, peppermint essential oil and rub it on your um, tummy and digestive, um, digestive um, area. <laughs> and you will definitely of half an hour uh, it will relieve your symptoms so folks this is all for today i hope you learned something new in this video if yes like it share it comment tell me what do you do to relieve constipation this is food in provence and i'll see you next time bye